Speaking to MTV News yesterday, the NMSA chief executive says the Small Craft Act is sanctioned and provincial governments must establish boards to oversee that boat operators observe the law. Una says safety at sea cannot be guaranteed unless regulators implement the penalties of the Small Craft Act. We are available to support the provinces and at the same time you know, the responsibility is also on our people to change their attitude so that we can all collectively uh, implement the act properly. According to NMSA, 10 out of 15 maritime provinces have commenced implementing the Small Craft Act. However, some are not fully implementing, primarily due to financial and capacity reasons. Uh, our officers have actually gone down to those provinces to be able to talk to the uh, administration to get them to, to get their PECs to, to appoint the, the board as soon as possible. But uh, at this point in time, uh, it appears that uh, we have not done uh, uh, any, any progress on that. And, and we will continue to liaise with them until you know, they get to establish their boards. A man in Alata was recently charged and has been convicted of a serious small craft offense and was imprisoned for five years. Una says NMSA is continuously consulting maritime provinces and providing technical support. As well as uh, advisory roles to the provincial administration board to be able to, to enforce the small craft act. Among the four provinces yet to establish the small craft board is Medang a province with eye-related boat incidents. Others include Gulf, Central and NCD. Jack Lepave, Junior National, MTV News.